just changed at Stafford on that. It should take about two hours to get to London because it is now like half six. So what I'm going to do is, I'm going to spend a few hours here in Camden. Uh, well, I've got to spend two hours here and I've dropped off my bags at this uh, drop place that they're looking after, it, hopefully. But I'm, um, at the moment, I thought I'd just go and source in Camden for a bit. Because I haven't been here in ages. There could, there's loads of other places that I could go to, but I thought, no, I'll come to Camden because there's about five or six charity shops, plus a few thrift stores. Of course, I haven't been in about six or seven years. And it's nice to see how it's changed. Uh, uh, and uh, so I'm just waiting for them to open up at their mine store. Okay, so it wasn't too bad in that mine shop. I managed to get some nudie jeans and a Reese shirt. Uh, yeah, I think I might go in scope now. Okay, no surprise there in uh, cancer research. It's too expensive. Okay, so the rest of this video is basically going to be a haul video and then uh, footage from the car boo and then the haul video from the car boo. I'm doing things a little bit differently this week. Um, the actual Depop event, that's going to be its own separate video. They are going to be released on the same day and you can pick and choose which you want. It's just that if I put everything in the same video, it's going to be like a 40 minute video and it's, it's going to be a bit too much. Um, but yeah, so the Depop video has got a little bit of footage in what I got and uh, my thoughts. Um, so yes, please continue. So these are the bits that I got from um, the charity shops in Camden. So it's a Reese shirt, uh, extra large, slim fit, and it's just like a blue one. I thought it was a set of five, but it didn't say six panels. I, I paid up for this. I mean, most of the stuff was expensive, but I got this from the actual mind shop and peace and love. Innes de la Flissange, <laughs> Paris. And it's Uniglow, it's large, it's a jumper sweater coming into that season. Uh, I paid up for that, I paid too much. I'm not going to tell you how much because it's too much. It's a Jules shirt which needs an iron. Just a Jules shirt and that was £4. Oh no, £4. I got some nudie jeans, these were £5. Nudie jeans. Quite a nice size as well. Three race, 34 leg. Yeah, that was a do all right. I got this for £4 as well. It's just a pull and shark yacht in, but it's a long sleeve and it's just nice. That's it. This is probably the most expensive thing I bought and also my favorite thing. It's a Star Wars fleece uh, collab with Uniglow. Again, Uniglow. Small, if it was an XL, it would be really good. Uh, but I paid £15 for it because there's none up online that I can see. However, there is some up in America for like 50 quid. So, yeah. We'll see, we'll see on that. It's hard to find comps while you're out. So, I'm in um, Victoria and I refuse to get two pretz in two days. So I'm looking for like a Starbucks or something. I think there's one over there. But, um, yeah, I just waited, right. I'm going to go see the, uh, what do you call it? Back to the Future musical. I should have just gone to see Hamilton. It's only there, look. Okay, 
Okay, possibly the best name for like a breakfast bar. Excellent. Victoria. How much is the train? 35. That's nice. Ah, no, no. Five. Do you, want a, do you want a bag for that? Um, yeah, if that's alright. I don't mind paying for it. Yeah, no, no. I'll give you a change first. There's one, two, three, four. I have to give you some change, sorry. Yeah, no, that's fine. Thank you very much. Yeah, it's $20. Just to be sure. Any yeah. <laughs> Any treasure. I was going to say a wad of cash, that would be lovely. Come to this car boot again. Five pounds. <laughs> Can you imagine? That's brilliant, thank you. Take Thanks care. very much, have a good day. I got three bits. Yeah, lovely. Thank you. Are you live on Insta? Yeah. <laughs> Drumming up some trade. I'm on TikTok. Yeah. Um. Guys, this is dangerous. I've already spent like half my budget and I've only just reached the bottom. Uh, I'll just take uh, the. Oh, not that one. This one. <laughs> Very Miami Vice, isn't it? Yeah, it's got a tiny <laughs> hole, but I can fix that. Yeah, I'm just gonna say, go. so much to do. So yeah, no, this is nice. Is you? Yeah. Not all. Well, How much for the uh, Levi's and the. Oh, £10 pounds for the for both. £10, right. I think I might scrape together because it's. I brought a budget and it's still already gone and I'm not even like down. <laughs> yeah, that sounds right. I did a car boot about. It's a lovely, lovely Kate Moss bowling bag. Oh. Right, you can have your fiver back. No. <laughs> and I think I've got enough. You know, yeah, one. We've even got the same bag. I've got that one. <laughs> it's nice, yes. Yeah. They fold up really nicely, yeah, don't they? Brilliant, absolutely brilliant. Three. Yeah. Four. Yes, that's it. Don't forget, I owe you 10p. Bag. Ah, <laughs> goodwill. There we go. Thank Paid forward. So <laughs> Sorry, babe. Yeah. 25, but I'll throw bags in as well. Yeah. I love Tory, but you don't find any of the stuff over here because it's mainly no, I know. an American brand. I 
Try it if you want, it's for, if it's for you, or you just want to. Uh, no, it's for you, brother. <laughs> yeah, no, um, it's a good price. Is it very a good, good price, price for you? Yeah, yeah, that's a very good price. It's just that um, I need to find a cash point because I've spent all my money. <laughs> Do you know where the cash point is? No. Right, so I um, believe it's still there. alive yes, yes. <laughs> so now I've got to go and see where is it now I've got to go to Covent Garden and I've got to go to the yeah, Delphi Theatre to see um that's the future uh but first I need to pay to get these bags stored because they're heavy and I'm not taking them in with me so yes <laughs> So I've just finished, uh, just come out of um, Back to the Future, it's amazing. <laughs> And now I'm going to go get some grub and coffee in the garden and then pick up my bags and then head to Houston because I've got, it's like 20 to 6 now. My train is at like half nine. See, last time I came here, this was shut. The guy came and gave me a basket because he saw me come in. <laughs> I'm coming in. Your fuss, where's your fuss? A year. A year. A year. Um, but yeah, I'm back from London. I'm back from the Depop event, which was on Saturday. And yeah, I did quite a lot of things over the weekend. I went charity shopping in London. I went to Camden, because I haven't been there in ages. And I thought, oh, I'll just go and have a mooch. And then I went to a car boot, um, the Capital Car Boot at Pimlico. 
and yeah i bought a hell of a lot of stuff i didn't think i would go i was going to buy a lot of stuff but i ended up buying quite a lot so this is a haul of everything that i bought in london which i didn't think i was going to buy i thought i was going to buy like a few items that's why i only took like a little bag with me i ended up having to buy a laundry bag like one of the big laundry bags because i ended up buying so much um yeah and then i went to see um back to the future the musical which is amazing by the way it's really fun um, and it's quite funny. It's kind of like it kind of I don't know why, but parts of it reminded me of like you know, like Xanadu, like a little bit like that. And it was like you know Rick and Morty. Obviously, the inspiration was um, Back to the Future, that dynamic. But um, yeah, it was a bit it was a bit funky, a bit weird, but altogether really good. And the light show and the lasers were amazing. Anyway, quick review over. <laughs> but yeah, I paid up too much that day uh, at the car boot. I did it better. I got these uh, Joseph London pants and they're like that faux velvet kind of feel. Guess how much? 50p, I know. 50p for some Josephs. I mean, to be honest, they're probably, and they're quite small, they'll probably only go for about, what, 12 to 15 pound? If that, if I put them up for like, say, 20, I'll get probably an offer of 15. I got this for 50p, a uh, fat face small shirt. Again, 50p, can't say no. Uh, Hackett Aston Martin, but it's a child's. <laughs> I just liked it. Right, so I, I did put some footage up, but I, I wanted to like, this is gonna sound really creepy, I wanted to film them because these people seem like they are, if you asked ChatGPT to put in Made in Chelsea rejects slash models, it would come up with these people. Cause they were just like, first off, they were obviously all in the twenties, but they were, they were like six foot stupid like stunningly beautiful and it was like they were like elves they were like those elven kind of like swanning about but they were they were like oh, what did they say what did they say oh, they like, oh designer cheap for it like they, they had that kind of like very clip voice where it was very it felt like every time that they, they were like running out of breath when they talked like this you know like <laughs> and i picked up this I was like oh how much is this and it was just a reese top and they're like, oh, there's Benjamin's. Benjamin, Benjamin, well, what do you want for the restop? Yeah, it was that kind of thing. It was, I was like, oh my God, are these people for real? Uh, and to be fair, they were just, they were very nice. And he just said, oh, four, four pounds. I was like, all right, I'll take it for four pounds. It's just a nice restop. And it's got, it's, it's made out of like really nice fabric, that kind of like brush cotton fabric. But uh, yeah, really like that. Um, there was a guy there and she was selling genuine Ray-Bans for five pounds and I was like put them down so I can get them put them down so I can get them <laughs> genuine Ray-Bans for like five pound I was like yeah and they came with the case they were in really good condition they were like aviator ones and this guy got them obviously but he was like um and ah like trying to come up with like a deal and I was like dude just take them you don't need to knock like a pound off uh yeah so uh let's see oh, I got this for a pound it's a cos blouse size don't know uh, but it's probably a small but it's a really nice blouse really nice I've checked it there's nothing wrong with it um, All Saints shirt small oh no it's a large it says large <laughs> but it's All Saints so expect it to be a medium but uh, All Saints shirt for a pound right I got these these are a punt and so I got these D&G Combat Rebel Label I don't know, they kind of do look genuine because, you know, you got to check all the tags and everything and the stitching, but they were three pound for Dolce & Gabbana. I was like, okay, and they're a bit funky shorts, sure. They're the same on the back, yeah. But I'm, I'm not sure. <sighs> My instinct is telling me that they're real. This is really nice. Oh, this is so nice. And I didn't, I was a bit cheeky with this girl. She was selling all this stuff and I did, she wanted a tenner for this. And I said, would you do eight? And she was like, well, I actually came down from 15. And I was like, okay, well, not with me. <laughs> First off, just saying. Um, yeah, but I checked it and it's perfect. There's no holes in it or anything. It's a Ralph Lauren polo. And it's like, it's like a Christmas jumper, essentially, like awesome. And it's coming up to the season. And this is made out of cashmere and wool. And I think it's, is it polyamide as well? There's like a button. 23% cashmere, 19% linen, 10% silk. Linen, silk, cashmere. Hello. <laughs> uh, yeah, but this is gorgeous. This is really nice. It's a large and it'll go really well. 
really, really well that. So, yeah, it's just a, and it, and it's really clean as well. Like she's obviously washed it, had it properly clean, but it's like so soft. And then it's just speaking like that, so soft. Size 14, mambo skiing and um, winter wear and everything. Just check the comps. Really impressed with them. I'm gonna try and sell it. If I can sell it before Christmas, then that's fine. But it's a really nice thick black jacket. It's, really, it's like proper like padded. Really nice. Like new with tags. Oh, new with tags, XL Orbis. And if not, I'm going to give it to my brother. A Christmas present. But if it sells for me first, that's fine. But I paid up a lot. I paid £20 for it. And I know Orbis isn't the brand it used to be, but it's a really good quality jacket and it's new with tags. I thought, that's fine. Even if I can get like 50, 60 quid, I've still made some money. But if not, it's a present. So... Everyone's a winner, babe. I got four of them. And yeah, from 1970 odd. Terry Anthony for Associated Biscuits. Oh, they came with the biscuits. And they're just really like, like 70s. Now, oh, I got this for a pound. It is a rayon pineapple vintage Aloha connection. Just a Aloha shirt. Size 12, I think. Yeah, it's a Levi jacket. I got it for a fiver. It was one of the first things that I bought. Uh, oh no, sorry, three for a fiver. So, yeah, I did I did pay up. Um, but the girl who was running the store was really nice. Anyway, uh, Adidas. Love you, Nights. I like that. I like the colour. Uh, a Jurassic Park one, XL. Official merchandise. Just a, a camo. Camo Jurassic Park, I don't see a camo ones. I just thought that was a really nice print. <laughs> but there you go. Just a really like funky print. There's a medium and I just love the print. I just love that print. It's a really thick shirt. It's really nice. Uh, it's almost like a denim feel. I got these and the band shirt for um, £10, so it's £5 each, which I can live with. Um, I got this barber shirt for £3. This was the first purchase of the day. Um, large which is nice nice check so that should do well Get about 20 quid on that too much stuff um i'm skinned now <laughs> after the trip and the food and yeah the travel and all the little extras that you pay uh i'm skinned so i'm gonna have to make a load of money this week to try and pay it all off <laughs> so i'm gonna try and put all these up uh today and yes as ever thank you for watching um Please remember to like, subscribe, and I'll see you all next time. Bye!